So this video will focus on the Alignment tab. So the Alignment tab can do a couple different things, and it's actually relatively easy to use. So let's first type some dummy text as we do. Okay, so you see we just have some text here. So Alignment tab does a couple different things. So it can, um, these three go top, bottom, or middle of the cell. Since this cell isn't very big, we can make it bigger to show what this effect has. So that aligns top, middle, bottom, as you can see. These align left, right, or center. And again, it's not really easy to see, so we'll make the column a little bit bigger. So left, right, center. I tend to think it looks nicest with two, both middle justification, but it's, it's sort of uh, your own preference. Okay, so then um, we have this. So these are um, some ways you can angle text. So I don't usually use this too much, but you can see how it works. So, you know. And again, you can always go into this alignment thing if you want to. So we're going to go back and um, angle this at zero degrees. Okay, perfect. So now we have something called wrap text. So wrap text is really important because it um, it really helps you allow to do other things. So let's just type in something long, like this is an example of a long cell. Okay, so that's great. So it shows up there, but it's taking up multiple cells. So let's just type um, example two in this cell and see what happens. So now this cell is cut off. So a lot of times though, you don't want your cells to be cut off like this because it makes it much less readable. So let's go ahead and hit this button called wrap text. So wrap text makes it so that you can see the, all the text in the cell. And sometimes you might need to make the cell a little bit bigger to see everything nicely. Okay, so that's one thing that wrap text does. Now the other thing you could have done is let's do a couple of undo's here and we'll get rid of example two. So maybe we you know, want this just to be a big cell because maybe there's a bunch of data down here and we don't want to, um, and we just want this to be a big, one big cell that's like a title for the, all that data. So instead of doing wrap text, which is um, pretty bad, or instead of letting this run into other cells, what we can do is go ahead and, and select the cells we want and do merge and center. So this is sort of, this can be like a title. And again, I like it, it looks like that. So, so that's what merge and center does. You can also do things like merge across, which doesn't center it, um, or just merge cells, which does that too. And then you can also unmerge cells to get back to where you were in the beginning. So that's so that's all an example of uh, the common uses of the alignment tab. As always, you can use this little um, button down here to see some more intense settings under alignment. Okay, that's all for this video. Thank you for watching.